It's the day of love, with many couples around the world planning an extra romantic day, and Prince William and his beloved wife Catherine are no exception, despite the princess's health scares. It's no wonder their Valentine's Day plans are underway as the next successors of the throne. Prince William will likely give his wife as much space to recuperate as possible, according to the former press secretary to Queen Elizabeth II. Elsa Anderson said she believes the Princess of Wales will shield his wife from any fallout as she recovers, as well as caring for their three children. This comes amid mounting pressure on the prince, who is also stepping up his duties as his father King Charles battles cancer. The former press secretary said, I think William will try and shield her from as much of the pressure as possible. I hear they've gone to Sandringham for half-term week next week to recuperate. Meanwhile, royal commentator Katie Nicole told Future King will most likely treat his wife to a meal at their favorite Italian restaurant in London. The royal expert said the Prince of Wales is quite the romantic, and no matter what they end up doing will make Kate feel special on this day. Nicole did, however, admit it's hard for the royal couple to dine out undetected by the public. If the big night out in London doesn't go ahead, she thinks the Wales could opt for a quiet romantic dinner at home. Although we're sure dinner at home in a palace is a little bit fancier than an ordinary home meal. The focus right now is for Catherine to get well so she could be back on her feet and return to royal duties. Being home like this reminds Catherine and William of earlier days when things were simpler, and they didn't have such busy schedules, says the insider. William's taken over the kitchen, the insider reveals. He's quite good at it, too. He's whipping up oatmeal and smoothies and roast chicken. He even made her favorite curry. William has a new appreciation for everything that his wife does. No matter what their grand Valentine's Day plans are, Nicole is sure the future king will make sure the Princess Catherine feels special, and will most likely have a thoughtful gift and a card for his wife of more than 10 years. The palace announced that the Princess of Wales underwent abdominal surgery in mid-January, but according to an insider, not everyone knows the full story of what happened. Catherine is being very guarded about her condition, claimed the insider. She and William are aware of the speculation. It's to be expected when you're a royal. However, the palace shared that the mom of three is making good progress in her recovery. Still, she won't be able to move around freely and no heavy lifting, said the insider. That's been the hardest part. Catherine isn't one to stay still. Their three kids, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis, are also eager for their mom to get better. William tells them they're not to be too boisterous or loud, says the insider, adding that the prince has stepped up to the occasion. Louis forgets sometimes that she shouldn't be jostled. As previously reported, the palace shares the news with the public, adding that she'll be out of commission for a few months. The surgery was successful, and it's expected that she'll remain in the hospital to 10 to 14 days before returning home to continue her recovery, an official statement read. Based on the current medical advice, she's unlikely to return to public duties until after Easter. The Princess of Wales appreciates the interest this statement will generate. She hopes that the public will understand her desire to maintain as much normality for her children as possible, and her wish for the personal medical information to remain private, the blurb continued. Kensington Palace will, therefore, only provide updates on Her Royal Highness's progress when there's significant new information to share. To make matters worse, William's father, King Charles, has been diagnosed with cancer, and he's trying not to stress about his family's health woes. We really appreciate everyone's kindness, William said on Wednesday, February 7th, at a gala for London's Air Ambulance Charity.